What is good? It's Robin Williams, aka the Royal Mobile, and uh, it's been a minute since I did a school vlog. Even though I'm not technically driving right now, we are on the Argo Ramen. Can you hear me? Uh, this video topic, as you saw by the title, is about up hills, driving up hills, driving down hills. Somebody asked me about a video topic on this. I don't remember the name. Maybe I'll put their comment right here. If I'm not lazy. Otherwise, I'm just randomly having my hand right here. But, uh, yeah, they asked me to do a video. If I had any videos about driving uphill or downhill, I don't. I have driven uphill and downhill. But Houston is not the most hilly place. Uh, for example, one hilly place I do know I've been to a lot is Austin, Texas. Austin has a whole bunch of mountains and stuff. So, but I've never ridden out there on my scooter or anything, but yeah, ups and downs. I have had experiences going like down and up, but it was like during like tunnels and stuff on the scooter. Matter of fact, I think I have a clip of that. Woo! How fast am I going? <laughs> I'm about to hit 60 soon! Woo! Y'all guys had me make me look through all my videos to find that one little clip, but it is what it is. Anyway, so if you live in a hilly area, I would say rethink buying a scooter. Ooh, you, you can't even see my eyeballs. Can you see my eyeballs? What if I do that? You definitely can't see my eyeballs. Huh? If I do that, oh, then you can see. But, uh, if you if you live in a hilly area I say rethink buying a scooter specifically a, a 50 cc scooter because if you didn't know if you're trying to go up hill on a 50 cc scooter and depending on how much weight is on that scooter a, aka how thickums you are how thick you are how big how whatever you are your scooter is gonna lose a lot of speed a lot of speed Hopefully you can hear me over the sound of the traffic because if not, oh well, it's still going up. I'm at Jack in the Box right now. I'm trying to get some grub on. Well, no, it's not actually for me, but whatever. Uh, so basically you lose speed if you're trying to go up hills. Of course, when you go down hills, you gain speed, which is always fun, as you saw in that clip. <laughs> but uh, um, yeah, like forget it if you live in a hilly area i don't know a lot of hilly areas like in what states is like colorado denver or whatever do they have like mountains and stuff not that if you're driving on mountains i'm just saying if you live in a very hilly area forget scooters like straight up because you you would be putting yourself even un more unnecessary danger because if say the speed limit for this this particular road is 30 just saying it, it is 30 you pushing your scooter to the max 30 at a 50 cc you're going as soon as you hit an uphill you're you're about to decline to about 10 miles an hour and i'm i think i'm being generous and all the cars are going to be like what trying to overtake you because you you're slowing down and then it's just like some cars overtake you way too close to the point where it's like you almost hit me so yeah maybe i'll come back a little later and talk about something else but right now this is Shauna, aka Ramen on Wheels, aka Bro Mobile, and I'll see you guys in a little bit, or that's it. So, Shauna Ramen is out. You see, I just did the outro. I mean, maybe it is time for me to go. Anyway, Shauna Ramen is out. Did I talk more about it? Okay, so that's just my take on this whole should you have a, a scooter? if you live in a hilly area. Another area I say, if you might not want to have a scooter, if you live in country areas. When I say country areas, I mean like 
for you to go from your house to the grocery store, it takes you about 20, 30 miles. If you live in those type of areas, it's like, nah, maybe a scooter is also not for you because it takes too long to go to a grocery store and your scooter wouldn't be able to carry much anyway. So you're talking about like on a 50cc scooter going 25 miles to the nearest grocery store, that's about a 45 minute ride just to get to a grocery store to maybe be able to pack four, five bags. Matter of fact, I've, the max bags I've carried on my scooter because I've been to the grocery store on my scooter and over shopped before. Oh, turned into a whole new video. But I've been on a scooter before and over shopped before and I'm telling you, I had bags everywhere. Not everywhere, but everywhere. I'm talking on the hook. I had about five, six bags on the hook. Just on, on the hook right there. On the arms right here, I had about three bags on this arm. Now I couldn't risk putting it on this one because this is the you know the vroom vroom the throttle didn't want to risk it you did up but three bags on this arm then i had a backpack on full of stuff then i had luckily i kept my backpack in there I had bags up in there then i had stuff in my backpack then i had bags on this arm now i didn't have it on the throttle but i did have it on this arm and i had it on my this arm right here so i was just like what 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 was i thinking what was i thinking but i did that so yeah, Shauna being Shauna. Well, that's it. I gotta go. I got things to do. Thank you for watching Roman and Wills, aka the Roman. I'll see you guys later. Deuces!